So here it is, friends. It was just delivered minutes ago. <clears throat> Pardon my voice. I, <clears throat> I woke up about midnight with a terribly dry, sore throat. And uh, I visited the clinic this morning and tested positive for strep. So I came home early and I have a little bit of nursing to do for myself. But <clears throat> I know you were anxious um, to see this, so I do want to take a couple minutes um, to open this and reveal if we have a brand new pen. It looks brand new. Sailor Fountain Pen Lacool Rose Quartz. It does have this PG-03B on the box. So that's promising. And it is all wrapped up in plastic. Um, the last box I received was not. So I think we have a winner here. <clears throat> Just hurry this along <clears throat> and not to disturb you with all the paper unwrapping <clears throat> we want the box it is the blue okay now that looks a lot different than the last one we received right um it is the blue box that i wasn't sure about and that little code on the side is the same so we have a new pin it is in a plastic sleeve it does have a tag on the clip. <clears throat> it has paperwork. It has cartridges that are not leaking. And if you're new to my channel, please go uh, back to yesterday's video and see how all of this means so much to me with the dilemma that um, we went through and that I shared. So I'm snipping a brand new pen and it is gorgeous. It's what I hoped for. Um, I don't know if you can see all the sparkles. It is a gorgeous rose quartz, uh, rose pink, <clears throat> so light it almost has a peach tint, especially in the camera. But there is some glitters in there, <clears throat> little frosty, frosty shimmers, Sailor Japan on the back. And after we check this out, um, I will be back in another video when I have more of uh, an operable throat and voice to share with you on um, some comparisons on the other pens. But first, let's open it up. And it is, there's the Sailor Nib Medium Fine. Everything looks exquisitely clean. Wow, now this is what <laughs> This is what I was expecting um, all along. I'm so pleased. And I am going to be inking with the converter. I don't need the cartridges. So in the other um, order, I was just going to clean the pen because I knew I wouldn't use the cartridges on this. I may use them on another, we'll see. But I already have um, ink ready, converter ready. So I'm gonna rinse this nib and we'll ink it up and do a writing test real quick with our beautiful Brand new Sailor Lacool in Rose Quartz. All right, I put my scissors away. I may may need them again. Okay, so the quick rinse. I'm just going to flush some water. You could do this at the sink and just run water in the nib section. Or here, pull up some water in the bulb syringe and I'll empty it to an empty jar so you can see if there's any testing ink residue I don't think you can see I got all my arms and hands in the way it's coming out clear oh the other one oh if you missed it um, it was inked with a, a silver light blue silvery shimmer ink um, aside from using all the ink in the black cartridges except for what they let leak in the package um, they did ink it somehow with um, a shimmer ink that was apparently in a cartridge that they failed to return so that's just kind of sad you know um, that someone would purposely do that because that much that much usage in um, in a return box cannot be an accident. 
All right, I don't want to struggle getting in here and waste your precious minutes. <clears throat> All right, trash. And I think I'm just going to uh, syringe fill this to have a, a clean a clean go as we get everything down. And since I rinsed the nib, it is wet with water, so it's kind of primed. Um, to accept the moisture and, and the ink running down. I'm looking for my syringe. I've got things in my way. <clears throat> so this is um, the Shikiori Sakura Mori. And I'll have to look up uh, what that means. And share it with you. Don't need too much ink in these because they don't hold, uh, the converters do not hold a lot. You can actually put a lot more ink into the cartridge um, after you've emptied it and flushed it out. So here we go. See, I still have quite a bit left there. But everything is clean. This is a push on cartridge I'm just pushing onto the nib section here. I don't know if that's water pushing out or ink. Okay, it's water from my little rinse. And again, I can twist um, the end of my converter and help to prime that um, nib section. So I just have to twist it in the correct direction, right? Here we go. I see some coming down. Right. And this pen is very lightweight. We'll go for a full review later. I just wanted to open it and share with you um, the experience of me receiving a new pen. <laughs> I love the size of this. It reminds me of my Pelicans. Um, you can write with it unposted and it would post very well. Very lightweight, not too back heavy. But we finally have, oops, let me get my ink down again. I didn't go enough. I didn't want to overdo it. So I can take my converter off and um, go ahead and fill this empty space that's being emptied in the converter by the ink in the nib. Oops. Oh, this is a pretty ink. It's not a shimmer, by the way. It's just a beautiful pinky peach um, sailor ink. Okay, this, it's medium fine. It says on the nib size, um, but sailors do, sailors and Japanese uh, nibs are more fine than the Western German nibs, so this is very much expected. Wow, my third attempt at a Sailor Lacool. I don't know, can you see that? Is the ink too light for you? And we have a rose quartz. Also, the packaging on this does say medium. Um, no, that does not, but it did somewhere else. <laughs> Says, it did say medium, but the nib says medium fine. And I, I have found that with some other sailor nibs that I have on my sailor compass. Um, so it does say medium, but the nib says medium fine. And our ink is Sailor Shikiori. Saku, Sakura. Mori. Okay. Guess you can hear that feedback as expected. And as I'm doing the very quick writing, my line width is getting um, slimmer here. So I do like this light um, ink in here. For now, it's going to be perfect. 
So this, this, this is the pen that I actually ordered it for and I've been waiting. Wow, look how dry that was. Okay, so I'm so glad that you got to join me um, in opening my brand new Seda Le Cool um, Rose Quartz pen. Thank you for joining me. You have a blessed day. Bye-bye.